Hey everybody, what's going on? Eric here. Hope everyone's doing well out there. Today's video is going to be an honest review about an honest food review. Good morning to all out there. So how is everybody doing? I hope you guys are doing really good out there. Let's talk about something that, uh, well, let's talk about obesity. Yes, obesity is kind of a bad thing, you know, overweight, got diabetes, heart problems, uh, possible breathing problems. I mean, you get sick, you stay sick longer. Uh, it's kind of a bad situation to put yourself into. Now, the problem with it is, well, with this shit that's been going on around the world, it's been a little bit hard for people to move freely as they want to and exercise if you go to the gym and stuff like that, uh, finding a way to stay and fit at home. Well, one of the things is, is that, you know, your intake, your food intake, how much you eat, what you're eating, the things that uh, uh, you're putting inside of your food can kind of mess you up as far as, you know, gaining weight. I guess no one has ever told him too much of a good thing is not necessarily a good thing. That could have been seven tacos right there. Two bowls of chili? Come on. Now, a plate full is not necessarily good. Where are the vegetables? Yeah, you could have done better. This just looks disgusting. I don't know what that was supposed to be. But, yeah, again, where's the vegetables? No wonder why we had a large shortage of toilet paper. I'm not really one to talk because I'm kind of a big guy myself. You know, 225 pounds. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of a big guy. Six foot tall. Um... Some people have health issues that, that create a problem for gaining weight. In my case, it was basically steroids and lack of movement that I ended up gaining weight from. And not because I uh, didn't want to move uh, or didn't want to do things and stuff like that. I'm kind of limited a little bit because of a, a low back problem. But on the plus side of things, I don't fill my plate like that. Two of three beef and pork meat pies. Right here I will be showing and pulling out the larger 12 inch one. These meat pies are probably about 50-50 or 60-40 to beef pork ratio. And uh, these ones specifically have mixed vegetables in them just for the added nutrition. Honest food review. Popeye's Chicken Canada. You have the empty boxes to show that, yes, I actually did buy them and did eat them. Chicken sandwich in the spicy version. Eight piece family meal spicy chicken. The Cajun fries. And I also had the biscuits. Damn! I got two buddy chicken sandwiches, burger things, from a w last night. That was basically the cost of the Popeye's what? chicken sandwich. What the fuck? I think I got better quality and better value getting two of these. Uh, buddy chicken sandwiches. In my honest opinion about the spicy chicken sandwich or their chicken sandwich in general, I felt it left you lacking. So I bought the eight piece chicken. I got the Cajun fries, six biscuits. If they actually could have made them like about closer to 
six inches in size, it would have been benefit. It would have been beneficial. Damn. Biscuits were actually the best thing. The Cajun fries, again, decent size. Box was relatively full, because I am kind of a fries guy. I do like fries. Regular or thick cut fries, I think are awesome. The crispy skin that you get on the chicken, I really like. Later on in the day when I had another two pieces though, I had the remaining four pieces over the next day, uh, two for lunch, two for dinner. After seeing the first part of this video at the amount of food that this person puts on his plate, um, I can't see him breaking up an eight piece family of chicken. Can you? With that said, hope you are all well and hope you enjoyed this video that I presented to you today.